Welcome to this week's Technology Thursday with CMB Operations. I'm Jeff Buick, and with me today, Carson Kaler, sales intern. Yep, he's also the sixth gen farmer, right? Correct. So tell me a little bit about that. What's, uh, what's the sixth gen farmer all about for those who don't know that? Yeah, so sixth gen farmer is basically me bringing you guys along on my family farm, and it's really about educating the people about what goes on day to day on a family farm. And how'd you get started with that? Yeah, so it all started when uh, I bought a used drone just to, just to play around with. And my dad said, you know, you should really uh, document what we're doing so that way we can look out in the future as a family, you know, kind of document our family history. So I posted to YouTube like everyone would to share it with family and friends and it, it really took off. And I did just drone footage for a couple of years until I got a good enough base of followers and then I started to vlog. And uh, I've been doing that for a little over a year now. Awesome, very good. So, so if people want to follow you on that, how do they do that? What are the good. platforms they can follow you on? Yep, so I'm on YouTube as Six Gen Farmer, Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok, all just Six Gen Farmer. So pretty easy to find me. Awesome. Well, this week uh, we're out here at our plot near Mitchell, South Dakota, mm -hmm. uh, doing our sprayer event, both for employees and for customers, yep. and really showcasing new technology that's available from John Deere, um, as well as on our Haggy sprayer as well. Uh, we have a high capacity nutrient applicator uh, and so we're uh, getting people out in the field we're getting people hands-on uh, with the technology that's available on sprayers and so you have a sprayer on your operation today right of course yep. you have multiple <laughs> the multiple sprayers yeah very yep. good so, so what do you use for technology on your sprayers today yeah so on our sprayer right now uh, we use just basic rtk guidance um, after being here for a few days might change. <laughs> <laughs> right. yeah, there's some pretty cool stuff. There's been a lot of good stuff. A lot, a lot of great good stuff. One of the things we want to highlight is called Vision Row Sense. And so uh, many people on your vehicles today have the lane keep assist feature now. So as you're going down the road, your vehicle can see where the lines are. And if you start to depart from where you should be driving, it alerts you and kind of helps steer the vehicle back in line. We have a similar technology available on our John Deere self-propelled sprayers today and it's called Vision Row Sense. And so we do this through optics, and it's normally mounted up here uh, in front of the tire. And as you go down the field, it differentiates between the plant and the ground. So if you can see color differentiation, Carson, that's how it tells where it needs to steer. Yep. So even if you go in and spray a field that didn't use auto steer for planting, this sprayer will turn in and it'll follow those rows going down the field. Now never fails when you're spraying the cell phone rings or something may come up on the monitor or you start looking across the field across the fence right yep and what happens when you do that when you're self-driving yep uh you end up running over a lot of corn or soybeans or whatever you happen to be driving through <laughs> damaging a lot of crops yeah so i like to call it tire blight yeah so <laughs> i like to call it so yeah the, the you end up running over some crop and actually on 30 inch rows um you'll you'll run over about 96 corn plants in one second yep if you're at about that 30 to 6 to 38 thousand seeds per acre so one second happens about that fast and so when you're spraying and the phone rings it's like where what do they need you know it, you're off to row more in a second so uh, Vision Row Sense is a product that really helps uh, with that and keeps the sprayer in a row. Now you may ask yourself, okay, the crop's growing, right? We may have corn. Yep. We're starting to reach canopy here before long. How do you differentiate between the crop and the ground? Yeah, well, you can't at that point. Nope. Right? So uh, the other thing that we can do is put feelers um, on the bottom of the sprayer. And so uh, we just kind of have a, a rubber feeler down there on each side of the sprayer that then will sense the row and steer the sprayer going through the field that way. Mm -hmm. Now, if you come across a drowned out area or an area where something didn't germinate and neither the feelers nor the camera can sense where the row is, it reverts back to GPS. So if you have a guidance line already for that field, it reverts back to GPS and then continues to um, follow that guidance line until you see crop again with the camera or the feelers pick up the, the crop down below and then you continue on down the field. So, AutoTrack Vision Row Sense, available on John Deere self-propelled sprayers. It uses the same activation for row sense that you'd find on your combine, so it's a great way to spread your investment out across multiple operations. But in the case of sprayers, again, adding convenience, adding uh, security to your bottom line because you don't have any tire blight going through the field. And so, um, if you want any more information 
please feel free to contact any of our uh, sales professionals at any one of our local CMB operations uh, locations. So, uh, coming from the plot here in Mitchell, I'm Jeff Buick. I'm Carson Kaler with CMB Operations, committed to being your dealer of choice.